done. I'm done. I'm done being insecure. Like, I was joking all day. I was joking. And I know we all have our insecurities, but, you know, I'm never seeing that. Believe it or not, I have insecurities. Yeah. You know the vibes. Yo, who am I? I go by J. I ain't know no savage shit. Free JT, I am that bitch, but I am not your bitch. I still pop my lips, still snack on chips. I take a nine inch strap. I don't take no dick. You know the vibes. Hey, bring it, bring it back. Squad, it's your girl J. You already know. It's Welcome Jay. back to J Bobs, where there's a whole lot of great vibes going on. Big period. Today's video, you guys, is gonna be a reaction video, but you already knew that. I'm back at it with Easy and Natalie's reactions, and this was actually requested. So at this point, I'm just going all over the place. But don't worry, like I told you, I made a playlist specifically for my Easy and Natalie reactions. It's called Easy and Natalie Reactions Marathon, because I know how much you guys love them. Love, 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 love. La, 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 them. Anywho, this video is being insecure to see how my girlfriend reacts. Emotional. Oh, they're trying to fuck with my emotions again. Jesus. Um, let's talk about insecurities. Um, personally, I don't like to deal with women that are insecure. Like, if you if you know you're insecure, leave me alone. You know what I'm saying? Um, so insecurities sometimes come after the fact. So sometimes you're with someone that don't have insecurities, and all of a sudden they got insecurities. And I feel like it's easier, or not maybe it's easier for the partner to maybe help the other one deal with their insecurities when they kind of like come versus you're coming into the situation with insecurities. It's kind of like, okay, you already felt like that. But um, some insecurities are small, some insecurities are like major, like you need counseling, therapy. So I don't know if this is serious, not serious. Like I'm just gonna nitpick at myself and see how she reacts. I'm just gonna see what this is all about this was um requested from my subscribers so before we get to this video please make sure you are subscribed to my channel like this video please do not leave this video without giving this video a thumbs up make sure your bell is on for all post notifications because you can get an upload for me two times a day three times a day late night times a day and i just wanted to make sure that you do your part you know what i'm saying when i upload you do your part to make sure that you are notified yes youtube be tripping but you know what i'm talking about i'm gonna do my part you're gonna do your part and then it's in god's hands share this video you guys make sure you comment down below if you notice my t-shirt wow love thank you so much to wildlife merch just blake i appreciate you for sending me drip honey Mm, I feel good and I look good. Let's get into the Oh wait, before I <laughs> You already know I got me some food. Stop playing. Stop playing with me. I'm hungry. This is like this is lunch. Okay, I got me some shrimp hibachi because you know I'm not really trying to do well, I'm not doing no pork. I haven't been doing beef. Chicken is like an eh, eh, eh. If I can't do seafood, if I've been doing too much seafood because I heard too much seafood ain't good for you anyway. So I got me some shrimp hibachi with veggies, broccoli, onions, zucchini, um, fried rice, some white sauce in there, you know what I'm talking about? And then I think um, I was eating on a, a vegetable roll and I didn't eat it all and I think it's in here. So I'm curious to see what that tastes like. Anyway, you guys, let's get into it. Oh. Fat again, bro. Right. Now, come on. You already know how I feel about it. Like, I can barely fit my fat ass in the swing. Look at me. Look you are not fat. That's that ain't nothing but thickness, honey. Day, and I feel like every time I post a freaking picture, like, I can see my curves and just some freaking ugly. Bro, I can't be real. What do you want to do? You know, you look at me this way. Hmm. What's up, easy, gay? Gay, 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 g
today, today we are just going to hang out with y'all a little bit. Yeah. You know what I mean? You guys said you guys wanted to get more vlogs, you know what I'm mm -hmm. saying? So we've been we've been paying attention. We've seen a lot of you talking comments. about a lot of you talking about y'all wanna see us vlog. Oh no! Oh my god! I heard a pin of so I'm so anyways, so Sheesh. We're just gonna be hanging out today, you know. It's like a sad baby. baby. No. no. Why do you say that? Well, you look, at me. look at this pretty face. Fine as fuck. Nah, but I You're cute. You. Like, Fine. Like, like, freaking pimple, bro. Needs to oh, get who I'm cares? Sorry, I'm honey, like, I got a pimple and it's like, I don't know, bro. Like you want it. Look, look at this pretty it. little face. Look at this pretty little face. But you just think I'm cute? Like, no, no, I think but you're, you're like, fine. I'm not always just trying to be pretty, though. Like, you're fine. Like, oh, you're so pretty, you know? So you say the kids. Say with your chest on. No, that's not what you said. Because you said, oh, you're so cute. To kids. You don't say, oh, you're so pretty. All right. You know? All right. Anyway, so, y'all, go ahead and tell uh, Easy she's beautiful below because, oh, no, she's tripping, tripping. But, yeah, we just have to keep with us. The yes. sun's going down and we wanted to, you know, vibe a little bit. So, let's keep going. If you're new to this channel, make sure you guys subscribe, the subscribe right button. now. If you haven't seen, <laughs> if you haven't seen our love story, and you're new to this channel, go check it out. Um, we've been, we're new to this. We're not true to this. Ooh, um, ooh. We got into a Wait a minute. I don't know if I like that. I don't. I, it was cute. It was cute at first, but I don't. We new to this. We not true to this. See, no, that's that straight. That's that straight woman talk. You need to be true. You need to be true, Natalie. You cannot not be a lesbian. Not be true to this. I don't know. I, don't, I ain't like that. She just had a, a, a straight moment. I don't like that. She started off as best friend. Started off backstory. as close friend. So us dope. Follow us everywhere. Follow Turn those post notifications on. We're going to get back to those post notification shout outs. Yeah. We've been slacking on that. It's been yes. crazy. But uh, yeah, we'll see y'all in the car. We'll see you in, in, in that car right there. Peace out. A town down. A -town I'm not really peace out. We'll see you in a minute. But do peace out, A town down. Peace out, A town down. What? That was that way. God, do you not watch any of Usher's video? Peace out, A town down. <laughs> I got it. I got it. Did you get the heel toe? Did you get the footwork? No, I got it. I got the. You got it. All right. I got the heel toe. No, I have a little bit of footwork. A little bit of footwork. I mean, it was a little. You got. A little cripple. So how you feeling, girlfriend? You baby whipping that car, girl. They annoying. We're still best friends, y'all. It's what I freaking love. We're still best friends. Alright. I don't want to win that one. <laughs> oh my nerve. Oh my god. What's wrong with this girl, y'all? <laughs> it's gay. I can't help it. Like, it's like one minute she my girl, and the next minute she my beast friend. Best friend. Best friend. Best friend. Get that out your mouth, Natalie. Oh Don't stink. God. Smell like something about saliva. I'm back. 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 i am back 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 i am Granted, some things, majority of the things that I wear sometimes, like when I'm first waking up or when I'm going to the gym, you know, the nighttime clothes, because when you at people's house, you need some sleepwear, and they give you sleepwear, so then the sleepwear ends up back in your bag, and then you go home, and then you still ended up wearing that sleepwear, and she's like, is that my shirt? Is that my shorts? Yes, it is. Leave me alone. <laughs> you sweater, and the person that thinks, that's her. And you be looking at your phone like, damn, just pretend it in a moment. Do you guys have friends like that? Because I'm not that friend, but in that moment, I was that friend to you guys. But comment below if you guys have that friend. I think that's actually funny because I know a couple of those people. You know those people? Yeah, I know them. Yeah. I, mean, I know that, but I'm not going to lie. Sometimes if I let someone borrow my stuff and then somebody compliments, I'm like, dang, I wish I I'm not going to say, I'm not going to do it to them. I'm not going to do it to them. <laughs> not that. She ain't right. I don't even like people borrowing my stuff. The only...
So ouch, bad. She. People, the only person that can borrow my stuff is literally Natalie. She know I barely. She is special. She, I barely let her borrow my stuff, but now that we in a relationship, what I want? Barely, girl. I be wearing your stuff all the time. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm flexing for the gram. I'm flexing for the YouTube. I'm flexing for the YouTube. Right? Why you lying to them? Is it easy game? Easy game? You do look really good in that sweater, though. Honestly, you actually bought that sweater for me. I'm so like, I did. Mad. It's like, like Christmas gift. Yeah, it was. I'm mad. Like, I feel like I just look ugly in that sweater now. What? You do not look ugly in the sweater. You look so cute. Okay, you're reaching. I mean, I just feel like, ah, uh, you know, I don't know. It's just like tight on me. Just, I don't know. It doesn't look good on me. A lot of stuff just doesn't look good on me anymore. It's so annoying, bro. So, why do you say that? That's a lot of stuff doesn't look good on you anymore. I mean, no, it's just not. Oh, that thighs look good. You know, it's just like, girl, first good. of all, you look good in no matter what you put on. Facts. I don't care what size you are at the moment. She. Yes, I have been gaining weight. Yes, I've gained weight. But for a long time, I've been my same size. My biggest size that I, or the biggest size I've ever been was in high school. Um, chubby face. Titties was chubby. Or maybe I was wearing the wrong bra. Like always. Like the wrong size. You know, waist was kind of chubby. Thighs was touching. Um... I was wearing a size 5 in high school. And then when I got down to a 3, I got down to a 1. The smallest I, I got down to was a 0, a double zero. Oh my gosh. But you know, start putting some stuff on that you done had for years. And it's like, yo, I don't even like how I look in this no more. When I first moved to Charlotte, I used to have this really sexy swag about myself. Like, all my clothes were fitted. They were really tight. It just always showed my body. I have always had my stomach out, my arms out, my back out, my legs out. And then I had gotten into a relationship. And I'm not blaming her for, you know, anything. I'm just saying what happened. I got into a relationship. And at that time in my relationship, my partner was coming out with a clothing brand. And... I literally became the brand so with that my whole wardrobe changed and I realized like you know I'm not wearing any dresses I'm not wearing any heels and I thought like you know why do I need it because I wasn't trying to impress nobody you know and it's one of like my my regrets like a personal decision like personally I regret regret that I even personally made a decision to not even keep myself up like I just kind of like was like yeah I'm, I'm comfortable she's comfortable you know I just got way too comfortable I'll say that I got way too comfortable and I ended up giving up like giving away all of my dresses all of my sexy clothing all of my club wear I ended up giving it away to the Goodwill because I was like I don't need it I just didn't feel sexy and it was just like and I'm still right now trying to transition to a different type of style like the whole t-shirt and jeans it's cool but I don't like I'm about to be 27 I don't want to keep dressing like that I want to be sexy I want nice two-piece sets you know um silk uh you know just like sundress material um yeah, I don't want to just be cutting down from head to toe. Cotton and jean. No, so. <laughs> um, yeah, we about to head to the park because you guys actually love that park and we love that park too. So it's a really cool vibe. We just love great energy. So, you know, we're going to bring the music gang with us and enjoy the vibe. We're going to walk around. Yeah. We're literally at the park right now, and I told Natalie I'm about to get some water, okay? Um, she doesn't like to be left alone a lot, um, so I'm not going to leave for too long, but I needed some water. I don't know if you guys have been noticing, but the birds are chirping for one. <laughs> Two, I have been acting a little insecure, you know, and there's a reason for that. You okay, know? I'm going to say. And I'm not going to lie, some of the things I said in the car, I kind of do. Because I'm like, hold on, let me listen to this sometimes you know sometimes i actually can get insecure natalie knows this i'm not really a confident person you know but lately like what us doing our spiritual work and stuff like that she's been helping me on this journey you know and it's freaking amazing she's like the perfect person guys natalie's the perfect person um but anyway 
like so i've been i've been doing she a lot of breath. but i do want to you know throw a little little monkey wrench in it we just got together we just got in a relationship and y'all know we've been best friends for years okay so i wanted to you know just pretend and act like i'm insecure in this moment i'm gonna go above and beyond you know what i'm saying so we're gonna try to get her reality. okay so she has insecurities but i guess some of the insecurities that she's gonna get into aren't necessarily like her insecurities um Make it make sense, I don't know. And that's why I've been kind of acting the way I've been acting. But let me hurry up and get back to her. Um, I don't want nobody to kidnap my girl. Hey. Hi. I still can't believe you've never brought me here before. Look, there's a freaking tennis court. Like, yeah, this is cool. we could have been spending our time. I know how to play tennis. Instead of in the house. No fresh air. Wow. Well, I mean, what, what do you want me to do? Think about these things next time. <laughs> Come on. Okay. Where we go? Are we, you trying to go down to the tennis court right now? Oh my god, well, I can't play tennis. It's like, you know, I'm not good at any sport I freaking play, bro. Like, oh my god. No, I'm serious. I wonder if they got any tennis rackets down here. This look nice, y'all. Look you at this. Me, you all of my nah, that's dope. Bro, I'd be literally benching on the court, sitting down on the bench. Damn. This is nice. What? Oh god, Jesus Christ. Do not hop over that, Natalie. Please. Needs a game. Please tell her not to. Oh, okay. Okay. Venus. Venus Williams, Venus and Serena. Oh, <laughs> why is she so that close to the net, though? It was the sound of literally uh, the tennis court. Uh, <laughs> that was the sound of the tennis court. This kid's coming. I appreciate the sound of this. You like it? Yeah. Dang, you know what we should do? What? I'm gonna start playing tennis. We can pick up a sport. I mean, I don't know, bro. I told you I'm not good at sports, and you know I gained hella weight, so it's just like. I don't Girl, know. are you kidding me? That's how you lose weight, playing sports. Yeah, I know, but you just. I don't know, bro. And then we got to put on the shorts. I will say, like, being in a relationship, you know, when your partner does have insecurities, you don't try to make them feel bad about it. You know, you try to help them. And I will literally say, you know, in my past relationship, yes, the one that you know about, she had some insecurities that I didn't know. Like, we didn't really communicate like we should have been communicating. And, um,. You know, come to find out, she just had insecurities. And also, you know, looking back, it's like, well, damn, I was trying to help you with that without knowing that you had insecurities. But I was trying to motivate you, inspire you, and help you. And, you know, you can't necessarily do stuff for people unless they want it. So, period. You know how you can play tennis and whatever. You can play tennis and your Adidas pants. Well, you know, I always wear my Adidas pants, and that's another thing. Are you calling me out on my Adidas pants? Like, bro, she complaining about it. Why do you gotta always call everything? Me out? I love wearing my Adidas pants. It's just like these. Are I love mine too. Fat. Aww. You are not fat. Why are you acting sensitive? I'm not acting sensitive, Matt. Like you know, I'm freaking. I gained weight. The whole night, it's all quarantine. Look, but damn. Guess what? Guess what? 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 You got me this way, all right? Did I like you when you were skinny? Yeah, you did. You were a best friend. No, no, no. no. I'm talking about. I'm your girlfriend. Yeah, true. It's true. true. So what does that mean? That you like fat girls. <laughs> <laughs> it's annoying. I'm not, I'm not Chinese again. I'm not saying anything. I love BBW women. You know what I'm saying? I love my big girls. But it's just I like, like my girls to meet on it. Cool. Fat, yo. Stop. Look at you. You are dead. Man, come on. Look at this. Look at that. <laughs> <laughs> Why'd you show the camera? I would love to. You ever had your stomach blowed on? Like, <laughs> no, okay. I like that. <laughs> that that was shouting. <laughs> it's funny, see. I oh know I was God. fat. That stuff looks so that soft. Easy game. She knows I'm freaking fat. Look at that ass, though. Aw, you look like a kid. <laughs> Go ahead, you want me to push you? If you can manage, then I'm going to wait. Oh my god, if you don't stop. Oh my god, damn. Come on now. Ooh. Oh, am, I, am I that heavy? <laughs> the last person I was pushed in the swing was Harmony. I haven't pushed nobody on the scene. So I mean, swing. Bro, not come on. Ever. You already know how I feel about it, bro. And in this angle, they can see my freaking double chin, bro. Jeez, bro. 
just annoying. Why? What? What? Like you know I have this problem. The fucking Maybe music in the background. In the swing. Look at me. Look That's my butt. thickness. Look at me. <laughs> Why would you grab me like that? I was trying to give you some TLC because you've been acting real sad. Are you sad? It's just so fing ugly. Stop. Why is she acting like this? I just do. Should we stop recording? Should we it's stop recording? Team. Just feel like I'm ugly, bro, and today's like my not my day, and I feel like every time I post a freaking picture, like I can see my Girl, you be fire so in the pictures. But she capping right now. Stop. Are you okay. No. Uh, you look beautiful. Be real. What do you want to do? You don't even. You look at me this minute. I don't even think for such a short amount of time. You look the same as when we started. That was a good one. Good save. <laughs> Have you got my heart now? Mm -hmm. What are you worried about? I'm just ugly. No, you're not. Look at you. I'm so ugly, bro. Beautiful. Like if ugly was in the dictionary, it'd be like easy's face, like <laughs> like a meme. Like we should tell Nizi oh Nizi and still here. We should tell Nizi game to meme me. Like in the dictionary. Stop. <laughs> She's annoying. <laughs> like look at I'm like hold the camera. Watch. This is how I run now. Like look at my ass. Oh look shit. Stop! Right the titties, though. That is not how you run. That is how it runs. That is not how you run. Stop! Because I don't have an insecure. I have an insecure run. I don't even feel comfortable. An insecure now. run. We have been Easy. working out. Don't beat yourself up. We've been up. working it out takes... for freaking two years, and I still am fat. <laughs> I'm serious. We well, have. Yeah, look at me. I'm still the freaking same. You only look, look the same because we're not consistent. Stop! Hey! What? Stop. You're hurting my feelings. The only person that's allowed to talk about you like this is me. <laughs> <laughs> Even though you know I would never. But you're not allowed to talk about yourself like this. You know why? Why? Because I'll beat you up for talking about the person I love like this. Okay. She's so sweet. I love that I'll braid. beat you up for talking about yourself like this? Well, Nisi Gang's here, so if you beat me up, then they're going to be here. And they're going to be my witnesses. Nisi Gang. She deserves to be smacked around a little bit for thinking this way about herself, Not right? Not smacked around a little her. bit. You're a freaking... Look at this tattoo. She's Not a the tattoo. Snack. Hold on. Snack. Hey. Snack. Girl, this Gatorade. <laughs> Thirsty. I don't know what's gotten into this girl. Made me like, hungry. Like, you don't look at me like that. Just keep it real. Look, I can't even be daddy. Like, you don't look at me as daddy, do you? How am I supposed to be looking at you as daddy? What do you say like that? You yeah, gotta look at me like daddy. You're acting like a big kid. Yeah, a big fat kid, huh? Oh, <laughs> Lord. Girl. She is showing out. Kiss me either. Is my breath sink? Oh shit. She been kissing all over you. Okay. Look at you swinging. I love to swing when I was five years old. Wait, hold on. Damn it. I'm wrapped up in this. Swing. When I was five years old, you see the article E what? on my wall. I was swinging on swing. A photographer came and was like, hey, can I take pictures of you? And I was like, yeah. yeah. I work for the newspaper, the local newspaper. Oh, like, yeah. He's a local kidnapper. <laughs> okay. Oh, shit. This is literally the setup story. Hey, can I take a picture of you for the newspaper? Yeah. No, I want that okay. That's kind of weird. Pictures of me that I remember telling my aunt. Guess what? I got my pictures. It's so it's so easy for women and you know maybe men too, but mostly women 
it's so easy for us to get into situations where we don't even think about like what is this really i've been into some situations y'all and it's kind of like why was i not thinking fast enough or why was i not thinking period why did i not, not question the situation i remember one time i was at a park working out and this guy was at the park with his son and he you know was watching me and made compliments about my stomach it was weird another time this modeling agency hit me up and just everything was weird it was like very childish and weird but i think I don't know. It was just a situation I shouldn't have been in. She was so mad. You let a random guy take pictures of you. But lo and behold, I was published in the newspaper. I was meant to be a star. And how old were you when he took these pictures of a young girl swinging on the swing? I already said I was five. You were five years old. Where were your parents? Yeah, I would have. I would have. I would have probably found the guy and, and beat his ass. Probably would have been fired for that because he. Oh, did you kick him? For sure. I had no permission for my parents. Right. Oh, oh my I god, bro. Can I finish? Okay. Well, I'm just noticing this freaking pimple zit on my face. It's not even a pimple, bro. Look at the zit. Like, you would think it's that time of the month, bro. It's just fucking ugly. Oh my Jesus, god. Jesus, bro. I can't even deal me? It's just with a it. Little pimple. Oh my god. Says the freaking girl with no blemishes on her face at all. None. No blemishes <laughs> at all. You think it's funny, huh? Come here. You kiss my pimple? Yes. I feel like when I be looking at people with pimples, not even on purpose, but like when I notice a new pimple, why do I feel like I get that same pimple? Do you? Does that happen to you? Literally. Like, I could be looking at the pimple right now on your chin. I'm about to get a pimple on my chin. No, for real, because these masks, these masks are breaking me out. I'm sick of it. You don't think I'm a zit face and you can play connect the dots with my zit? Where's the other zits to connect, huh? There's one right there next to it. Let's just point out our blemishes together since you feel so bad. Let's see. Okay. Look, look, I had a huge zit right there. E. Yeah, it went away in a freaking second because you're beautiful and you're perfect. Unlike me, I was freaking created by Spawn. <laughs> Your mom wouldn't like to hear that. Oh, not her. I'm dead. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. Okay. I'm done. I'm done. I'm done being insecure. Like, I was joking all day. I was joking. You like that joke or no? No. I knew she had an eye booger. I didn't, I didn't know not? she did that. I don't like acting like this. Did she wipe it on her, though? Oh, um, yeah, that's Yeah, because you're beautiful. And I know we all have our insecurities, but, you know, I've never seen that. Believe it or not, I have insecurities. I'm not telling you, but I do. That insecure. <laughs> Oh, girl, you stop. <laughs> Don't be showing them my baby. Whoa. Okay, Nizzy, you can't see your booty. No booty over there. But look, I be joking. I was joking all day. And uh, you know sometimes I do actually have insecurities. And uh, you actually are like that. And I appreciate that you didn't just let me talk about myself like that. Because how many times have I told you I was going to beat you up for talking about yourself like that? Tell them. She tells me all the time, guys. Like I told you guys in the beginning. I catch myself acting a little insecure. But then I always got my back Everybody when it comes to Everybody has yeah. their insecurities. Yeah. That's what I want y'all to know. Everybody. Insecurities are normal. Mm -hmm. yeah. um, just don't, you know, don't, don't let it go too yeah. far. You know what I mean? Like, if you're feeling a little insecure about something, be like, hmm. And like, if it's something that you can change, then work on it. If it's something right. that you can change, embrace it. Exactly. You know, there's things that I can... Facts. If there's something that you can change about your insecurity, work on it. If there's something that you can't fix, then just pay attention to the stuff that you do like about yourself. You know what I'm saying? A lot of times, you guys, we make situations worse. I had to learn that the hard way. We make situations worse. So it's not about what you're going through. It's about how you get through what you're going through. So it's not always just about the insecurity. It's about how are you going to work around that that insecurity, you know what I'm saying? Or how are you going to build yourself to be secure within yourself? Because everybody has insecurities. I, but I guarantee you, Beyonce and Michelle Obama got insecurities. I promise you. We ain't perfect. You be insecure, but... 
I'm joking. I'm There's things that I could be insecure about, Girl, you know? You're so perfect. How could you be insecure? Well, how? Th there's things that I've been made fun of about. Oh, really? Yeah. No way. Okay. And you know what? I decided to embrace it and, yeah. and use that to my benefit. Yeah. Like, say, my birthmark. Oh, People my used birthmark. to try to play me. Or, you know, when kids are really mean. And they'd be like, dude, what is that? Poop. Oh, heck no. Nah. If I went to your school, I'd be pooping. They face me and pooping in the poop toilet because I wouldn't even talk about your poop face because your face ain't pooping. And I'm like, nope. My mom said I was kissed by an angel. Ooh. Oh, Aww. yeah. Although this was a jokey joke joke, I do have my own insecurities. But if you have any insecurities, don't let them get to you guys. Because you're beautiful. You're absolutely Stunning. gorgeous. Stunning. And if you want some more motivation, head over to my beauty channel. Because that's all Ooh. I talk about. I motivate. She's very and motivational. I uplift. Yes. And I teach you about beauty. And yeah. That's the self love and stuff. Yeah. Yes, guys, self love is very important. I'm working on it myself. Natalie is helping me with that. Do some mirror practices. Do some mirror practices and talk to yourself like, "Hey, I love you. I'm a you, baddie. I'm a baddie. I'm or a bad, bad bitch. Yeah. Or if it's a guy, handsome, handsome, good looking, looking. You're like, stud. Looking like some chocolate of some kind. Whatever color you are, you're caramel, either vanilla, vanilla, vanilla chocolate, Ooh. dark chocolate. <laughs> they are crazy. Yeah. Shoot. Oh my god. Alright, All right, let's go. Alright, I'm like, okay, at this point, y'all are just playing. Anywho, you guys, this was a really good video. Um, I love the fact that, you know, they they make videos and it's like it's a point in it. So I know some people are like, yo, I don't know if I like their video because it just seems like it's not real. Like they just seem like they're always planning something or y'all just think it's a plot. I don't know. But they be having like some valid points in their video. Like at first, I ain't gonna lie. At first, I was like, yo, why did someone request this video? Like this is not a video that I would have wanted to watch. But by the time I got to the end of the video, I definitely see why they put this video out. And you know, it's a, it's for, it was for a good cause. So shout outs goes, shout out always goes to Easy and Natalie. They are just phenomenal people, amazing people with beautiful souls. And I hope that you enjoyed this video, you guys. Um, make sure you are subscribed, like, comment, share. Follow me on my social media. Click the links down below in my description. And I hope you're having a great day, a blessed day, a beautiful day. Be safe, stay clean. Sign out to the next video. Peace. Just focus on you, baby girl. <laughs> J vibes. You know the vibes. You know what the fuck going on. And I'm at this bitch. Yeah. You know the vibes. It's Jay.